Forecasting is the science of predicting the future. For the past 30 years, we have worked with many businesses and governments to help them improve their forecasting process. We have worked with the Australian government to forecast COVID-19 cases in each state. We've developed better forecasting methods for pharmaceutical expenditure in Australia. We've worked with energy companies to forecast peak electricity demand in coming years. We've worked with Tourism Australia to forecast future tourism demand. And we've forecasted the numbers of prisoners across all states of Australia and the number of students in each subject at Monash University. Knowing the challenges of industry and using data from our own consulting experience, we wrote Forecasting Principles and Practice, an online and free resource available to students, educators and practitioners around the world. Our aim is to teach our students how they can do this type of forecasting as well and to better prepare them to face these challenges once they graduate. The Interactive Online Textbook is a great teaching resource for us and our students. It allows us to directly link students to relevant materials for them to explore the concepts at their own pace. Tutorials start smoothly by simply loading in the included FPP3 package. This provides access to real-world data examples and forecasting functions used by professional forecasters. The FPP3 book combines simple explanations with code examples that students can easily copy, try, and modify to produce industry-ready forecasts. This allows our tutorial sessions to be focused on understanding the forecasting concepts with less time needed for programming. Probably the biggest thing I appreciate about the FPP textbook was just the natural process of learning as you go from chapter to chapter. I think it has a very appropriate gradient of complexity in the ideas that you explore. Um, and on a more technical standpoint, um, I really like those little animations that you could play um, in seeing how various parameters affect uh, different statistical concepts visually. I think that was very uh, conducive to my learning. I really enjoyed study forecasting. FPP is beginner friendly and provides all code and data for students to get started. Having free access from anywhere at all times using any type of device made it really easy to study. I will definitely be using FPP as an up-to-date and easy to navigate cheat sheet in the future. The two things I liked most about the book were that it was written in a really straightforward and intuitive way, meaning that it was really accessible for people to learn and understand, and I found that really, really useful. Um, and as well as that, it had all the R code for all of the examples written out, so you could see where each output was coming from, and this was a great reference to come back to when I was doing assignments and classwork. I used FPP for my business forecasting unit at university. As somebody who had never coded before, I found FPP's ability to integrate code with statistical and forecasting examples invaluable. FPP has served as a background for what has been so far my favourite unit at university and hopefully has formed a lifelong interest in forecasting. I couldn't recommend FPP as a textbook enough.